Sydney Crosby is talking today about the trash talking Rangers fan who made him laugh. And as you have probably heard by now, Crosby sent that fan an autographed stick after the game. David Highfield reports it was an unusual situation for the Penguins captain. Over the years, Sidney Crosby has endured tons of taunts, insults, and chirps, but none quite as entertaining as the Rangers fan from the other night. Nick LaPica's zingers were so good, Crosby sent him an autographed stick after the game, which read, Good chirps, take it easy on me next time. LaPica was seated right next to the Penguins' penalty box at Madison Square Garden, so when Sid was sitting there, he got an earful. He had me laughing a bit, I think. Uh... You know, I've been in that situation before. Guys can kind of cross a line or take a little far sometimes. I thought he, he did everything in pretty good taste. LaPica said he wanted to tell Crosby things he hasn't heard before. So here's a sampling of his one-liners. Hey, Crosby, Malkin would have more cups if he had a better supporting cast. Hey, Crosby, when Gatorade wanted a tough guy, Justin Bieber turned them down, so they settled for you. Hey, Crosby, you were voted third toughest Canadian behind Celine Dion and a close second to Avril Lavigne. He had the section laughing, had me in the, um, you know, one of the officials in the box laughing. So it was, it was all in good fun and, uh, you know, one of those things doesn't happen very often. Crosby respected the creativity and is getting respect in return. After receiving the stick, LaPica said, when he's on your team, you couldn't own enough of his stuff. But if he's not on your team, you're praying that he just has a bad night. I think he moved up a few spots for me. Now the question is, by giving that autographed stick, has Crosby inspired other hecklers to show him what they've got? It's not a competition, so... Uh... David Highfield, KDKA News.